So, Luna's Hal. Yeah, it's actually pretty good. Um, I'll be the first one to admit. Precision Instrument is actually better than what I thought. Um, I was hoping that it could do head one body, and in some instances, it can. But, um, just general util, um, the fact that it does X in range is a million times better than what I thought it could ever be. Anyway, you guys don't know me for weapon reviews. I don't want you to know me for weapon reviews. Um, I'm here to talk about the Special Dilemma, another, like, TWAB video. Not live comm this time, unfortunately. Um, initially this was going to be competitive socks, and maybe that will be my next video. But I figured that we might as well get this out of the way. Is there a special problem? How do we solve it? Things like that, etc. Now, before I immediately jump in and say no, I'm actually going to give Bungie their props here. They actually do a pretty good job of explaining all the systems they've used, the pros and cons, and why they're choosing the system that they're going to be choosing Final Shape. Now, that being said, um, I do think there is a little bit of a special problem. Or, there was. I think there have been times where, yeah, specials have 100% been too dominant. But I would say now, that's really not the case, with the exception of things like conditional, um, chaperone, for forerunner, like, exceptions, really, to the rule. There really hasn't been a special problem since, I want to say, like, Word of Wolves, or Arbalus or Lorenz Driver. Um, they've done a pretty good job of identifying, for the most part, at least um, from like trials, I'd say. In sixes, that's a completely different story. But in trials, I can typically tell that, okay, this guy just used two shoddy shots. He's probably not going to get shoddy for the rest of the game, and if he does, I'll know how to navigate around it. And once again, this isn't me saying that the meter system is perfect, it's far from perfect. Um, they even highlight some of the issues that I've had, for instance, loading into a sixes match with no special, I'd just prefer to just not be loaded in at all. Um, obviously, I would say before the most recent patch, um, it could be a little difficult to get special, but also at the same time, it could also be too easy if you knew how to cycle your primary abilities and the special that you did have, allowing you to stockpile. Now, in a surprise to no one, Bungie takes issue with this, that I highlight the fact that the meter system primarily benefits higher skilled players over lower skilled players. Anyone can guess why that is, but to break it down, game sense, gun skill, allows for the higher skilled player to generate 3.5 times the amount that the lower skilled player does. This has led to lower skilled players for going special weapons almost entirely in favor of the full uptime double primary brings. And even something like competitive, you'll still find lower skilled players more likely to get a kill of a heavy weapon than what they ever were with a special weapon. Bungie follows up by concluding that weapon balance is somewhere one sided as a primitive shotguns is the main solution, while other special weapons fall behind accordingly. This has led to a rich get richer matter in their eyes, where the good player continues to be good. Now, don't get me wrong, I get what they're saying and the stats make sense, but this is another case of identifying symptoms, but not the actual real problem. At least in my opinion, there isn't a real space for players to learn the game and improve, and similarly there isn't really any incentive to want to improve either. Most things in PvP are well within reach for the average player, besides maybe something like Ascendant which isn't really very desirable besides a few cosmetics and extra focusing chance. And finally, scrub mentality leads to people preferring to lose with their favorite gun because it's better than winning with the weapons they deem to be unskillful. Why would the lower skilled player ever want to give hand cannons a chance if he's just convinced that his scout is going to take him flawless? An easy solution to this, in my eyes, would be a tutorial that lets you try different loadouts, places you in different scenarios, for instance, learning the closer gap by sliding rather than just solely sprinting or jumping. And playlists that promote improvement and not just waiting for the crack duo or solo on your team to carry you. While things like the Not Forgotten grind separated the boys from the men, there isn't really anything like that now that people care to get good for. It's also not surprising either to hear that shotguns have more than 76% of special kills either. They have a fairly low barrier to entry. Conditional is incredibly strong and pairs well with Igneous, 
And that combo covers most ranges, with the exception of scouts, as we saw in multiplies. There's very little risk involved with the playstyle, while also maximizing the reward. Which really sucks, because it's one of the only answers to the ability meta that we have now. That isn't to say that if you nerfed Overshield's bubble or well, that the conditional 120 problem goes away, because it really doesn't. But it does open up a bit more loadout diversity, because I can confidently slide engagements without feeling like I'm throwing. And finally, the game is played practically the same since Forsaken, with a couple shifts here and there in the form of Beyond Light and Subclass 3.0's ability uptime. It's not surprising that the lower skilled player is struggling shifting from one extreme where you have special at all times to another extreme where you have to think a little bit about how you use your special weapon. If it hasn't been apparent by now, no, special weapons really aren't the problem, with a few exceptions. It's more of a balancing act issue. I don't know if the new blended system that they're going to be introducing Final Shape is the answer. It seems like what we had before, but with special ammo crates in the mix, which, uh, yeah, doesn't sound great. But anyway, I appreciate you guys for watching. Sub, comment, like, algorithm, please. Um, thank you guys for making it this far. See you guys next time.